Here is Paulina Edmond, 17 year old from America. This is her second Grand Prix event as well. And her mother, Nina Edmonds, originally from Russia, part of her coaching team, and she learned how to coach. Her mother did under Alexei Mission. And she was sixth at Skate Canada this year. Beautiful triple S, triple toe. You can really see that back outside edge. has been part of a three-way battle to be the American top lady, along with Ashley Wagner and Gracie Gold. And currently, Ashley and Gracie are coming out just a little bit ahead of the game. Helene has been plagued by under-rotations on her jumps across the season, so moving forward, that'll be one of the things I'm sure she's going to be trying to improve. Flip. When you were talking about under rotation, I think that's a prime example right there. I do feel this was under rotated. And again, there with the triple loop. The technical panel get to review anything they find suspicious on the landings in slow motion. So it's very difficult to hide mistakes when they're done slowly. So you better make sure those jumps are clean. American Paulina Edmonds skating to the soundtrack of Gone with the Wind. The Worlds, 2016 Worlds, will be held in Boston, and Canadian Elena Elena Chartrand Elena also Elena skating Elena to that soundtrack. Elena no doubt influenced Elena by the Elena fact Elena that it will Elena be held Elena in Boston. 
earning some brownie points now while she can. Know your audience. <laughs> Well, Paulina is the reigning four continents champion, but yes, Carol, as you say, it's a good battle within the states alone yeah, between really Wagner is. and Gold. It's a tough world out there. Being a figure skater does nothing like figure skating to keep you accountable. You know, you perform, you put yourself out there, and right away you got your results in front of everyone. You know, you got people deciding. Today you were good, today you were not, and now they have video review like you mentioned, so there's not nothing you can get away with. If your jumps are under rotated, it will cost you. There's no more benefit of the doubt. And those little under rotations just eat away at your score. And as soon as you see the blade chatter like that, when somebody comes down from a jump, the technical specialist is gonna be calling review right away. And they're gonna look at it in detail. We always say to our skaters, you know, the number one thing is don't make them think. If they have to think about it, it's usually no. So you want them sitting there going, yes, 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 yes. She is going to need a score of 113.84 <laughs> to take the lead away from Rika Hongo of Japan. <laughs> And she'll get it right now to take the top spot, 117.91, the score for Polina Edmonds of the USA. Looking to best her sixth place finish at Skate Canada earlier. 